We should tell him the truth. Oh, that was definitely the dulcet tones of Sir Patrick Stewart himself. So, who are they? Easy. They are the Illuminati. Now, the Illuminati was an organization in Marvel Comics that consisted of the most smartest slash powerful men on the planet who would come together in the shadows to direct certain Marvel events in their favor and also manipulate certain aspects of the world to operate in a way in which they preferred. Now, while members of the Illuminati have changed over the years, the core of the Illuminati was essentially Iron Man, Tony Stark, Black Bolt, Doctor Strange, Mr. Fantastic, Amor the Submariner, and Charles Xavier. Now, we definitely see, uh, well, we don't really see, but we hear Charles Xavier speaking to Strange when he comes in. And Charles Xavier is definitely being played by Sir Patrick Stewart himself. The second thing that we see that lets us know that they are in the movie is the Ultron robots, which are based off of the Iron Legion robots from Age of Ultron. They are also in this movie. We see them leading Strange up the steps. And why the hell did my camera get like God tier bright? We see the robots leading Strange up the steps towards the main antechamber that they are all in. We've also seen uh, leaked set photos of Tom Cruise's Iron Man on set walking around with Doctor Strange. So we definitely know that he is also going to be in the movie working with Strange and the Illuminati in some way, shape, and form. Now, we've been hearing whispers for a while now that Mr. Fantastic has been cast in the MCU, but Marvel has been keeping it super hush-hush for a while now and they weren't exactly sure when they were going to reveal it i feel as though we may be getting a reveal of who's going to be playing mr fantastic in this movie now for black bolt and the inhumans i don't know if we're going to be getting black bolt and the inhumans the inhumans tv show kind of failed to a hardcore degree chances are we are not going to be getting a live action black bolt i would love to see a live action black bolt don't think we're going to get one Namor the Submariner is another one because we have we do know that he's been cast in Black Panther 2 Wakanda Forever. Chances are he may show up in Multiverse of Madness as a member of the Illuminati. We also do not know. But it looks as though the Illuminati have essentially come together to try our Stephen Strange for crimes committed. He may have been framed for crimes committed by the Illuminati version of Stephen Strange that the members of the Illuminati may think are dead. Because when we do see their version of Strange, he has America Chavez, and it seems as though he's attempting to cast a spell. She's able to break free, and when she does, she accidentally casts both him and herself into the multiverse, which is the next time we see him, he's in the completely bombed out and fucked up Sanctum Sanctorum uh, that has that black goo and it's the rooftops blown off. And he's all like creepy and he's uh, like palpatine. He's like, things just kind of got a little bit out of hand. Uh, but yeah, that's the Illuminati. That's who those individuals are that they got my boy Patrick Stewart to come back and play uh, Charles Xavier one more time for. His Charles Xavier is definitely not going to be the Charles Xavier from the uh, X-Men movies because he has said that he would never come back and reprise that role because that Charles basically got his ending in Logan. But it does seem as though he is coming back to play the more evil version of the character. It would be interesting to see that one of the members of the evil Illuminati is uh, the original Nick Fury, which it is an R Samuel Jackson Nick Fury, but it's the white Nick Fury. Like, I... I I really want to see like the, the original Nick Fury one time in the MCU and you can just make him a bad guy and just have him be beat and just go off and do his own thing. But yeah, that's who uh, those guys are. They are the Illuminati and they are about to fuck some shit up. I take that back. They are about to get fucked up because we do see Wanda with her face covered in her face and shirt covered in blood walking out of their headquarters so chances are she bodies every single person on that council and i really really hope that sam raimi gives us 
a shot for shot version of uh, Professor X dying. The way he was killed off in X-Men 3 when Phoenix just blew him up. It'd be interesting to see Wanda just pick him up and just pff, pop him like a balloon. But yeah, that's who those guys are. That's the end of the video. Comment down below if you're excited to see the Illuminati in the MCU finally. Comment if you're a little bit disappointed that we're getting the evil version of the Illuminati and not the good versions. But hey, I'll take any version because this movie looks fucking amazing. And I will catch you in the next one. Peace.